Hello, beautiful Geminis. My name's Alila. Welcome to the Gifted Hermit. Uh, I live in London. Newbies, let me know where you are in the world. Subs, hey. On the Gifted Hermit, you only have to give me a thumbs up if the reading resonates with you in any way. If it doesn't resonate with you, then try to come back next time and hopefully I do resonate with you. It's a very general reading, so I'm going to reach out to lots of people. On this particular occasion, Geminis, I'm going to be doing how you see each other spread it picks up on two energies that being you and another energy right it's a love reading three questions oh alarm bells <laughs> um there goes the sirens three questions two energies first question is how you see each other mm, 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 mm. eight of cups i love the eight of cups uh things are a bit all over the place for some of you maybe someone's viewing somebody here as quite confusing or let me just put the microphone here on me properly as an option oh yes i said it baby i said it i'm gonna keep shit real real around here i do feel like um someone is viewing somebody here as moving on you know also as you see in the illustration they know that they've moved on so someone has to accept it gemini either you or them remember i say everything with the biggest heart i'm not here to judge and yeah <laughs> so the eight of cups is um it's like someone's viewing somebody here as someone that's wanting to move on uh they're not quite satisfied like something's missing uh, and and they've basically walked away in some aspects right whether that be physically emotionally like someone was like nah you can't give me what i want you can't give me what i want man <laughs> um so that's one energy okay and then we move on to the judgment card so it's almost like someone's viewing somebody here as very liberating um someone's viewing somebody here is like you you're calling you was meant to come into my life uh life lesson karmic lessons okay someone's viewing somebody here as very courageous um promising fulfilling so yeah do let me know what's up with that guys all right gem gems <laughs> the second question is what you want ten of pentacles it's like someone wants money <laughs> no it's not just about money someone wants to achieve long-term goals someone wants maybe this energy they've walked away because someone wasn't serious gem gems could be you could be them well this is someone that wants something uh long-standing right stability somebody wants stability of course someone wants to um get their money up you know money's important it's about laying foundations for somebody here right so someone might have wasted someone's time and you wasted my time with my emotions so i'm going back to work because that's all i know could be an earth sign <sighs> who knows <laughs> and the next energy and what they want they want to give back six of pentacles is like they want to give back maybe someone wants to try again somebody wants to help those less vulnerable um and do what's right it's like somebody wants to do what's right here and and give to the people that need them rather than the people that don't that doesn't right maybe someone wants to ask for help but they don't know how to ask for it could be you gems it could it could be them you know i'm sure y'all gonna let me know because that's your job your job is to let me know what's up <laughs> then we have um the king of swords and the temperess and the last question is where they believe it's going yeah so uh the king of swords he talks about intelligence so it's about using your mind someone believes that they're going to learn from this um it's also about being creative and successful in your life for yourself so someone believes that they're going to be all right regardless Someone believes that they're going to grow wiser from this. Someone believes that their wisdom is going to benefit others. So either you, your wisdom is benefiting others or their wisdom has benefited you in some way or another. Okay. Someone believes that they don't mind sharing their opinions. They don't mind having, 
deep, serious conversations. It's whether people can take it or not, is what I'm feeling the need to say. And the last card we have is temperance. Temperance is about patience. Temperance is about remaining the cool cats. Temperance is about someone believes here that they're going to cool things down. Yeah, they're going to just relax a little bit. They're going to moderate their life in every way possible, whether that's having too much sex, drinking too much, being too attached. Everything's going to slow down, thinking too much. This is about letting your action be appropriate to your actions. So someone believes that they're going to start to change now and, and perhaps uh, behave in a, in a more better way, right? Ooh la la, what a reading. Uh, give me an angel card for Gemini, please. Gemini, what does Gem Gems need to know, please? Had two cards come out there. There's nothing to worry about. You are safe and this situation is under perfect control of divine providence and universal order. Only infuse loving thoughts and emotions into this situation to ensure that the highest possible outcome flows effortlessly to and through you. Beautiful card. I would take a screenshot if I was you. Joy. Joy is the highest energy of all. It's the magical sense that everything is possible. Joy springs from appreciating the gifts within each moment yeah I'm, I'm, I'm even going to go far as to say within each and every moment joy allows you to attract and create your present and future moments at their highest possible levels gem gems lovely y'all are happy you're going to remain happy and up lift yourself upbeat about life cheeky little devils <laughs> <laughs> now I'm playing. Anyway, gems, I hope you love that. Please remember, you only have to give me a thumbs up if I resonate with you. Look after yourself and also others. Catch you on the rebound. Mwah.